Hello everyone. Today we are going to read Why are bubbles round? The author is Sukanya Sinha. The illustrator is Swapnil Kapoor and the publisher is Pratham Books. So let's read Why are bubbles round? Twins Manu and Maya were on their way home from school. At the traffic signal, they saw a man selling bubble making kits. He dipped a plastic wand into a bottle, took it out and blew into it. A stream of bubbles floated into the air. Some reflected rainbow colors. So there are these two twins, Manu and Maya, and they're on their way home from school. They're sitting in the school bus and they see a man selling bubble making kits. Yeah, have you seen them before? You have a bottle with soap water inside it and there'll be a wand, which is a stick, which has a circle at the end of it. The man is dipping the wand, the circle into the soap water and blowing into it. And when you do that, bubbles come out and some of them have multiple colors, rainbow colors. You can see it as a reflection on the bubble. 10 rupees. He cried out. The light turned green and the bus drove off. So here you can see the man with the bubble making kit. You can see here, this is the wand. There is a stick and there is a circle, the red circle at the end of it. And you dip the circle into the water and you blow into it. And that's what he is doing. Ma, can we buy a bubble kit? Said Manu as they had dinner that evening. Ma said, you can make one at home. Why don't you try it tomorrow? So they asked, the kids are excited to make bubbles. And so they asked their mother, can we buy a bubble kit? And their mother says, why don't you just make it at home and do it tomorrow? Let's see how they make it. That night, Manu and Maya dreamt of bubbles. So they are so excited. They are thinking about bubbles. They are dreaming about bubbles. Next morning, Maya mixed shampoo with water in a small red bucket. She carried it to the garden. Manu found some pieces of wire in Baba's toolbox. He twisted the end of one piece. So there was a small circle at one end. So here the kids are getting busy trying to make a bubble kit. What are they doing? They're first collecting Shampoo water, soap water, it's shampoo is also soapy. And so Maya is mixing shampoo with water in the bucket. And they are in the garden, no spilling water in the house, no? So they are doing all this uh, work in the garden. And Manu found some small pieces of wire in their father's toolbox. And what he did was he twisted the end of one piece of wire in a circle shape so that there is a, it looks similar to the wand that the bubble seller had. It has a, a wire stick and the rest of the wire, one end of the wire is twisted into a circular shape. He dipped the wand into the soap water and blew into the circle. He blew hard. No bubbles came out. 
so what happened what did manu do he dipped it and he tried to blow but instead of going he went really hard and no bubbles came out blow it like this said maya and she blew gently no bubbles came out manu tried again woo they shouted as a stream of round bubbles floated into the air kulfi chased them and barked so now they are finding they are they making bubbles it worked this time so in so maya told manu blow it gently the first time it didn't come and the second time it came there was a big stream of round bubbles and they are floating and their dog called kulfi is chasing them i am going to make a different bubble blower said maya she twisted the end of her piece of wire into a square i bet my bubbles will look like little boxes she said so maya wants to have fun she doesn't want just those round bubbles so what she tries to do is she twists her piece of wire into a square shape and she thinks that the bubbles will come out like little box shaped bubbles let's make other shapes too manu said manu made star shaped and triangle shaped wands he was eager to see bubbles of different shapes too so manu went even further what he did was he started making triangle shape star shape you know he is imagining that the bubbles will come out shape like triangles or stars and he is excited he wants to really see these bubbles of different shapes not just round let's see what happens the twins watched kulfi chasing the bubbles all of them were round how strange so what happened with all of those different shaped wires nothing new they were all round bubbles again why why do you think that is let's see ma we tried to make bubbles of different shapes but they are all round complained maya round is a special shape said sukundar aunty their neighbor who was chatting with their mother she worked at the science museum in the city so when manu and maya didn't manage to make square bubbles or triangle bubbles they went to their mother and they said um, uh, ma ma we tried to make different shape bubbles but they're all round why is this and so her, their mother was chatting with the neighbor aunty sukundar aunty who works at the science museum and so she knows a little bit about science and she said that round is a very special shape let's see how this is when we make bubbles we blow air into bubble skin the bubble skin stretches least when it is round if it is any other shape the skin will have to stretch more to hold that much air bubbles do not like that added sukundar aunty bubbles are lazy they don't like stretching manu shouted and he ran off to blow more bubbles with maya so what does sukundar aunty say what she says is see you can see how the bubble comes out of this wand it is square shaped so when the bubble comes out 
it's coming out kind of like square but the bubble skin right the skin that contains the air we are blowing into it that doesn't like to stretch it likes to just stay as tight as it needs to be to hold the air and the best shape for this is round round means least amount of stretching if you have a square box like shape there will be corners no and so you have to stretch that much extra to and the bubble skin is not able to stretch it prefers to just stay as tight as possible which means it is round in shape classroom activities how do you make soap bubbles squeeze some liquid soap or shampoo into a cup add some water to make a soapy solution to make sure it does not become too watery add the water in small quantities get pieces of wire twist them into different shapes dip the frame into the soap solution then hold it up observe how the soap film clings to the frame forming a square circle or triangle according to the frame blow gently on the soap film to make bubbles when the bubbles leave the frame what do you see they may start as different shapes but they always form round spherical bubbles so how do you make bubbles at home you first make some soapy water and add water little by little so it doesn't become too watery so you can use either liquid soap or shampoo and then you twist pieces of wire into different shapes like circular triangle square star you can try different shapes and then see what happens when you dip the frame into the soap solution and hold it up when you see you can see the soap skin on the on the frame and it's just there you can see it and it forms the same shape as the frame and then see what happens when you blow gently into the soap film it initially it when it first leaves the frame what is the shape of the bubble at that time is it the same shape as the frame it will be the same shape when it is just leaving and then the minute it comes out it collapses back into the round shape the spherical shape take a dab of paint from your paint box mix it with the bubble solution now blow bubbles what color are they if you are on earth the chances are that your bubbles will not come out in a different color as the paint is heavier it is pulled down by gravity and collects in a little blob at the bottom of the bubble do you think adding natural colors like beetroot juice to the soap solution will make your bubbles pink try it out the 7 year old daughter of a japanese astronaut asked her mother to find out whether she could make colored bubbles in space the mother mixed some red fruit juice with the bubble solution and guess what she got red bubbles why because there is no gravity in space the color pigment did not collect at the bottom of the bubble so here they are saying try to take some paint 
just a little bit of paint and mix it with the bubble solution so that the water looks color right and then try to blow bubbles but if you are here on earth you know about gravity which is the force that holds you down that helps you stay on the ground instead of floating like a bubble so if you are on earth the chances are that your bubble will be the same transparent color because the paint is heavy paint is heavier than the air that is trapped in the bubble so it just falls to the bottom of the bubble and it stays there it doesn't color the whole bubble what about natural colors like beetroot juice or carrot juice or something try it out and and tell your friends what happened it looks like if you are not on earth if you are in space it is possible to make color bubbles a japanese astronaut this is uh, an astronaut as a person that travels to space in a spaceship and her daughter asked her to try it out and she tried it out with red colored fruit juice and she got red bubbles because there is no gravity in space nothing is holding the paint down and so the color spreads around the water and the skin of the bubble why do bubbles burst a bubble is a bit of air wrapped in a very thin skin this skin is made up of three layers soap on the outside water in the middle and soap again on the inside as the water evaporates the bubble bursts so here they are talking about why does a bubble burst so if you imagine the bubble the bubble skin is made up of two layers of soap film and in between the two layers there is water in the middle and the water is what helps the soap skin hold together if the water is what keeps the soap skin wet and as long as the soap skin is wet with the water it stays together it is able to hold on together and stay round but when a bubble is goes up in the air the water starts drying up right and so when the water evaporates when it start when it dries up fully the bubble skin is not able to hold on there is no water there anymore and so the bubble bursts i hope you enjoyed this story and now go outside and have some fun with bubbles thank you the difficult words in this story are reflected showed on a shiny surface spherical round to cling to hold on to to observe to see gravity the force of the earth that pulls everything on or near it to the earth evaporate to dry up change from liquid to air try these questions write in your own words what makes bubbles round try the experiment mentioned in the story create your own bubble making kit with different shapes and see what happens with beetroot or carrot juice write down how you did it and what did you see if you can share videos with us that would be great